Um, but another mover that we're watching this morning is Williams Sonoma, and this is an important part of the retail picture as well because it reflects both higher income consumers as well as what's happening in the home products business. So the company's numbers beating estimates here. Um, first quarter sales in particular, comps up 9.5%, which is a lot better than estimated earnings per share, as you can see, and revenue better than estimated too. I was looking at the comps by segment. Pottery mm-hmm. Barn comps up 14.6%. William Sonoma itself, the branded store, down 2.2%. West Elm continuing strength up 12.8%. And Pottery Barn Kids and Teen up 3.1%. So by and large, We're still seeing the the furniture and furnishings business strong, even as William Sonoma, which is more towards sort of cooking stuff, is a little bit weaker here. Uh, Gross margin, by the way, also expanding to 43.8%. Analysts questioning a little bit the sustainability of all of this, given the macro environment. Yeah, I'm glad you brought that up. I was just reading a note. Um, the notes are trickling in here. Uh, from Morgan Stanley, they rate the stock equal rate. Price target is now cut to $160 from $170, so $10 shaved off there. They say the results continue to challenge the narrative of sales and margin reversion and saying, however, bro- uh, the broker is stuck in the middle on whether sales and margin are sustainable. So Morgan Stanley kind of on the fence here. Here's another one quickly from KeyBank. Uh, Bradley Thomas noting that William Sonoma reiterates its guidance, even though the second quarter demand has slowed slightly and there's risk of consumer deterioration. So we've been talking about in the retail Maybe some shadow changes that we haven't picked up in the macro data because it's not up yet. Um, maybe there's something in here. There's some more tea leaves. You, you see any tea leaves in here? I see tea leaves <laughs> everywhere, but I, they're not all adding up to the same thing. Yeah, so we're that's getting kind a different read on a lot of these stocks tricky. today. Yes, exactly. Yeah.